Uh, alrighty then. This is a video I've wanted to make for a while, you know. Especially with, you know, spring and summer of 2018. J you know, it's getting really heavy. The North Face drop part 2 just dropped today. I'm currently filming this. It is Thursday, 3.36 p.m. New Jersey's time, Eastern Standard Time. Whatever, right? That doesn't matter. So, I've seen a lot of people post it throughout YouTube. Big channels such as Kais and smaller channels, which I don't, you know, know the name of. But I've seen them, you know, throughout. All you gotta do is look up Supreme Dying, and that's all you'll find. By the way, new setup. Let me know if you guys like this or not. Um, I mean, I guess I, the main topic of this video is, is Supreme dead? Now, a lot of people are gonna say, hell no, Supreme's not dead. I mean, you always see stuff sell out. Well, yes, but when you think about it, six, seven years ago, when Supreme was at its highest peak, you know, shit was selling out like that. Like, if you didn't have a bot, and I mean like one of those like $50 bots, you know, you, were, you would be screwed. I mean, there would be no possible way of you to get anything. And I've gotten lots of Supreme really, really easily this season. What, my newest Supreme pickup? I have this. The Supreme MLK shirt and the flannel. Which, the flannel was almost 200 bucks, right? If that dropped, like, five years ago, would have sold out so fast, right? And here's the thing. Supreme does it. If it's not, like, a collab, it really doesn't sell out that fast. I mean, like, oh, okay, like, the, the pinball machine. Of course that was going to sell out in five seconds. I think it sold out in three seconds in the UK and five seconds in the US, right? And it didn't even drop in Japan. There were only 300 made. I mean, that's that's crazy. But, I mean, when you think about it, look at the sellout times. They're, they're getting, I mean, again, if it's not a collaboration or just a hype piece, you know, it's not going to sell out. At least not that fast. I mean... Like, this, it eventually sold out. Like, my Hellraiser shorts I'm wearing now, that sold out. Like, you know, these sold out pretty quick. Not the shirt, but again, like, this season, the accessories. Because, I mean, what, the, the Supreme Tennis Balls, these sold out hella quick. I mean, they're not going for a lot, but, like, you know, I'm not opening this. I mean, like, because you, ne you never know. Supreme accessories can get pretty expensive, you know? I mean... I have a lot of accessories from this season and past season that have sold out hella quick. But, I mean, you know, it's it's one of those situations where it's Supreme dying. And you, you see other companies, you know, like Antisocial Social Club, who only drop two times every year, right? And then you see Bape, who's, like, dropping stuff every week, right? Every Saturday. And that's not even selling out. If it's not, if it's not like, a shark hoodie... Or like a collaboration, it's not gonna sell out. Like the the uh, I have a few bait pieces that have sold out. Uh, I have like a bait crew neck, a shark crew neck, a zipper up and down. You've probably seen me wear it a few times in my videos, but you know that sold out hella quick. And retail on that was like three hundred, which is absurd for a crew neck. And that wasn't even resale. I bought that on release day from baitus.com. I mean, you know, it's, it's, it, it's, it's like, you know, even, even Nike collabs, those don't even go for a lot anymore. Even, even Vans collabs, they don't, they don't go for anything now. The Supreme Air Force, you can easily find for 200, which like, when you think about it, that's, that's like as much, that's, that's about the same amount as a Jordan Retro. I mean, what, they, I have a Air Jordan 10 OVO box right here, right? Retail on this was 225. I guarantee, look on GOAT, Stock X, you're going to find them there for 200 even stadium goods. You'll easily find it for under 300 which is really good for a Supreme for a Supreme shoe. And I know people gave the Air Force One a lot of hate, but honestly, I don't think it's that bad of a collaboration. Do I think it is a bit ugly? Yes. But when you really, like, think about it, the collab wasn't that bad, right? And the Vans collabs with, like, with the, um... With the uh, green skulls, you can you can find those for way under two hundred. Used, you could probably find them for one fifty. New, one eighty five. That's like the highest I've ever seen it, right? And that's that's not a lot of money. 
especially for a Supreme collaboration on a van shoe, you you could easily find Supreme vans that go for a lot. Like the Blood and Siemens. Don't go th- those don't go for a lot of money, but you know, like the 666 vans, those go for those go for a good amount of money brand new. And I mean, when you look back at Nike, um, Nike collabs with Supreme, you got the foam posit ones. Those are easily eight hundred, eight hundred, anywhere from eight hundred to a thousand dollars dead stock. That's crazy. And the hype behind it was so intense that in New York City, the NYPD had to shut it down. That was real Supreme hype, and that wasn't even for the jersey. That was just for the shoe itself. Right, and then there were the AF twos that dropped last season that sat, and you could easily find it for one hundred. Right, so obviously Supreme isn't doing as good as it used to do. Is Supreme still gonna make over two million dollars this season? Of course, it's Supreme. You know, even if it was dying, you know, people are still gonna want it. All right, it's not about the hype. I don't buy it for the hype. I generally buy it because it's it's honestly not a bad clothing brand, right? And I can get called a hype beast. I even think of myself as a hype beast. For the pickups that I've done this year, with Supreme, getting Human Races, Calabasas, I mean, what, OVO 10s, I finally got a pair of Revenge Storms. That's that's a good amount of hype beastie pickups. I got my first box logo. Those those are big pickups, right? But, I, again, like, I don't really know how else to explain this. I mean, like, new Supreme hoodies, you could easily find them even in resale stores for not a lot of money. Uh, you know, it, it's not it's not hard to get Supreme anymore. And, I mean, until the new box logos drop, which is probably going to be either later this month or in July, which, in my opinion, I think I'm going to have to try and get a, a bot for that because, you know, it's a box logo, right? I'm not going to just sit here and say, oh, box logos are the dumbest thing. But considering people, you know, think it's stupid... Just because I'm spending hundreds of dollars on a little, on some words on a t-shirt, and that's not me. People spend, people make a living off reselling Supreme. That's, that's not what I'm trying to, you know, I'm not trying to rat on anybody that doesn't like Supreme or makes a living off Supreme. But when you, again, when you think about it, it's, it's not as hyped as it was a few years back, right? Again, stuff sits. If you go on Supreme right now, you know what? That's what I'm going to do. Um, th- you know, there's easily stuff here. Like, I mean, this is this is crazy. I'm looking right here, right now. I mean, there's uh, there is a lot of stuff sold out, but there's like, th- both of the North Face pants are still on here. Like, that's, that's crazy. North Face pants usually sell out hella quick. I mean, like, of course the backpack sold out. But there's, like, normal Supreme backpacks that are sold out. I mean, there's keychains. Oh, the, most of the Hanes collabs are still on here. Even, the like, the Supreme wheels and the, um, and the, uh, independent trunk, uh, truck. That's, that's still there. So, I mean, I, I'm just, that's crazy, right? I mean, it, it's, it's stupid. And, I mean, Supreme isn't a cheap brand by any means. This shirt, what, about $60 for one long sleeve shirt? All right, I, this came out first week of spring and summer 2018. So, obviously, I was hyped for it. So, you know, it was, I, I, I don't really know how else to explain it, you know. Um, I don't really know what else to say here. Um, I guess just kind of expect more Supreme pickups this year. Um, maybe I'll do a Supreme collection. I actually did do one, and that was like a solid 20 minutes long. But, like, the file corrupted, and it won't upload to YouTube, so that's kind of screwed, and now I have to make another one, so that's pretty shitty in my opinion, but whatever, that's not my fault. Uh, the quality might be a little bit worse, because I have to film this on my Mac, uh, because my phone is, I got my phone taken away, but, um, yeah, so, yeah, I think that'll do it for this video, um, again, leave your opinions down below. Uh, yeah, so, uh, also go follow me on Hype Kids, uh, Instagram, Double Trouble Kicks, um, go follow his YouTube, Hype Kid, go subscribe to me, like, comment, favorite, all of that good stuff, and I'll see ya.